So, a lot of people say that you need a heavy chain to have a dope look, to put a medallion, to put a pendant on. Me, myself, personally, I disagree. DNF Diamonds Reviews Jewelry, Episode 2. You guys see the description. It is from Jacoji. So, we're going to get right into the video. Bang. Before I get started, as always, peace and blessings to everybody. Wish you guys nothing but the best. I did this video like two times. FedEx, boom, it came in that. And then everything packaged up. The chain inside the bag. The bag inside the, this little pouch. Sticker. And then this is... A box I got from Jacoji. I ordered this on Wednesday. Then Thursday came. And Thursday came. And, you know, it just came. I went to sleep. Pause. And Friday at 11 a.m. got it. So, like, a, a day and a half. Authenticity certificate. Flat curve. 4 millimeters. 26 inches in length. 5.1 in the gram weight. The gold purity is 14 karat gold, yellow, slash 585 plum. And packaged by, is it, is Braden. So it wasn't him. That's out the way. And I have it on there, there ready for you guys. This phone is crazy because the settings, front microphone, back microphone, 360 Omni mic, like all this. You know, we're in the studio, not where I actually make bench work. You feel me? Submariner bezel mold from a cat. Once it's done, it's done. Don't need to redo this again. Anyways, this is a review. Why did I pick Jacoji to do a review on? Why did that Jacoji is the second one? Well, number one, he shipped really, really fast. Number two, I know some of the jewelry. I know this chain. So I know, kind of expected what I, what I expected. Hear nothing but good things. But the most important thing, I want to support small businesses, especially in the jewelry industry. Straight up. I don't have to pay retail for this. Like, I don't have to pay retail. We wholesale. You know what I mean? So I'm supporting and paying retail when I don't have to. So support and for the reviews. It's got to be official. No email, no Instagram. I just place the order. Just in the, at checkout, let them know, yo, DNF Diamonds. There's seven DBAs up under that company, jewelry company. I'm purchasing this. Let's just make sure you do a good QC. Mostly just check the class for me because I don't like lobster class because of the spring and so on and so on. And uh, that's it. So you guys can idea from far away how it looks. And the medallion, the pendant is here. Then we'll show it again. So the pendant, the bell, and then the pendant. Let's see, like the bell and then the pendant, like that. And I rock like three of these at the same time. Same length pretty much. And bomb up close. Th these these cameras are crazy. Like I don't see this. But now we are gonna set it right here. Give me a second. Relax. Like that. And I'm gonna grab a chain and then get you guys a look at it. So uh it's a four millimeter, 26 inches, 14 karat gold bomb out the way. Super laser cut, very, very shiny. This thing hits like crazy. I already knew that. You know what I mean? Uh, as far as the stamps, hold on. One thing I don't understand is why his lobster clasps are always not brand new per se, as you can see. You see the Jacoji logo, Italy, and then on the other side, you see Jesus. No, we're not doing that. We're not doing this today. Where's that side? There it is. 
see the 14 karat stamp. I'm going to uh, repolish this myself, so it ain't no big deal. I just hate these lobster class, but it's what it is. I paid about, uh, so total with shipping, $25 shipping, I believe. Uh, I paid $910, I believe. Uh, a little bit higher than what I can provide. Same chain. Not by much at all. Like $70, $60. If you want a nice chain. For under $1,000. And some of you guys probably not even with 26 inches. Pause. More like 22, 24. So it'll be less than $900. That hits. Outside of laser Saturn moon cut. Which is what we do. As well as the regular moon cut. Show you guys in the next video. Um, <clears throat> When you got these diamond cuts. It's just like a rope kind of. But this has you know a little bit more of a. Presence that attracts the eye. I would say. Because really it's just a Cuban curve. But his are really really flat. So I get why he calls them. You know. Flat curves. Go on and grab you this chain. It's a nice chain. If you're not going to put a medallion on it, I tell, just like I tell all my clients, wait, save, go up to five, six, seven millimeters. You know, if you like that, more of that choker style. As far as Jokoji, um, uh, so... I like because it try to educate people like me. We're going to have jewelry school. Now I have to pay for it. We're going to start from the beginning to the end. When we're done, you're going to know everything you need to know, including how to set up a website, the whole nine. But that's only going to be for people that are really serious about starting a jewelry business. And you will need some capital for some inventory. Even if it's just you're starting out with silver, you're still going to need some capital. Feel me? But that we that's why... I like what he does. Now, what I'm going to do is going to, I've always done it, it's going to piss people off as far as in the industry because I'm going to tell some secrets. So, this is, this should be plum. I'm going to hit it with the gun in, in the next video. I'll let y'all know. Uh, this is 14 karat. So, plum should be 585, nothing less, meaning 58.5% pure gold out of a 24 karat bullion slash brick. That's 0.999 or 0.9999, 100% pure gold, slash 24 karat. 14 karat, we have 58.5%. With me, you usually get a little bit thicker of a chain and maybe a little bit more in weight. I don't do like the next review where they called me and said, hey, it ended up being more weight, so that's why we didn't ship it. Uh... You got to email, pay us the other 70 something dollars and we'll ship it. Beautiful chain. I already knew it was going to be. Just was wondering on the quality control. You know, uh, really haven't inspected it link by link. Uh, my caliper here where I'm at. This is a studio we're in. Um, the caliper I have needs a battery. But it has to be the four millimeter. Because the three millimeter weighs less. But when I did the Miami Cuban review three millimeter from ishot.com, it looks just like this as far as the width. Check it out. Is this for people that want to buy this chain? That's why I make the videos a little long. Pause. So people actually see it. Before they buy. But let's weigh it. And let's get out of here. Here's the scale. You guys can see? Yeah, hello. Tee it up. 
drop it on a, let me use this hand so you guys can see. I could have just switched chains on you guys. 15.1, exactly. On point. Oh, that kind of hurts my feelings a little bit. Let me try it again. Most people get a point four, one point two extra with Jokoji from what I've seen online, or a point five, a point eight. No love for jewelers. All jokes. I gave Jokoji a nine out of ten as far as his company and everything. Because he doesn't have a phone number. As far as the chain, this is a 10 out of 10 chain. I already knew that. Uh, again, not a really big chain, but three of these is kind of how I rock these type of chains. Iced out medallions, pendants on here. You guys will see it. Um, it's a beautiful piece. I am going to clean it. This is what we get with these new <laughs> phones, baby. We get that creep mode zoom. You see what I'm talking about? Most people won't see this. Most people won't see this. Most people not going to loop it. Most people not going to get this close. You know, and it was the last one because as soon as I ordered this from him, I went right back. Let me see, cop another one, 26 inch. This one sold out, so like the last one. So, probably old stock just to keep it a buck. And uh, some advice as well don't uh, put the chain in a plastic bag. To where the gold hits against itself while it's being traveled. Wrap the gold up in jewelry paper. Then put it in here. Just advice. In jewelry paper. And you tighten up that paper. You flip it. A certain way you do it for a chain. So it doesn't hit and scratches each other. When I say each other, I'm talking about the length. You heard me? So, I'm going to polish this. I'm going to hit this with the gun, let you know if it's plumb. Meaning 585. I don't need to measure the length. As you can see, it's 15.1 grams. And the 3 millimeters, like 9 or 8 point something grams. So, it can't be the 3 millimeter at 15 grams. Or could it? Because my 4 millimeters look a little bigger. We'll see. The next review, we got Leary's coming up. Diamond cut rope for a special pendant. We got Tracks NYC. We got Daniel's Jewelry, Inc. Of course, we got stuff from my company. We got Rolex. We got Las Vegas. You guys, I'll introduce you to some companies that you guys don't know. Just to show you what trash looks like. But my reviews are honest. They're going to be honest always. You've seen the It's Hot. It's an honest review. And this is an honest review. This is a beautiful chain. The price is perfect. Be careful with like eBay and other companies. You know what I mean? Because they like this same chain right here weighs like seven point something grams. And they want like $600, $545 for it. When... This one here, 15 grams, cost me $880 or something like that. You feel me? So, again, I know the chain. I know the quality. It is what I expected. Tight links compared to others. Not the tightest for, for a Cuban curb or a flat curb as he calls it. But for me, just perfect. So they don't kink up. And for me... Just perfect 
They put a medallion with some VS1s, VS2s, FG in color on here. And have a nice looking ounce of gold around your neck. So the pendant, 12 grams, plus 15, boom, full ounce around your neck. Plus some diamonds or, you know, just solid gold. So highly, I recommend this. Or save your money, get a bigger one if you're not into the 26th length. You know what I mean? And go up to five, six, seven, you know. Or if you really want a Miami Cuban and you're stuck in a Miami Cuban, like I tell all my clients, wait and save. Six months, a year, whatever it takes, and get what you want. But if you want a nice chain, something that hits, that, that is going to bling bling and people going to see it, it's going to turn next. Don't have to spend too much under $1,000, 26 inches. Four millimeters, not the, not a big chain, but it has a presence. You know what I mean? Let's go ahead and spend seven hundred and ninety, eight hundred, nine hundred dollars. I recommend these. If you want to save a little bit, I'll show you guys if you, the same chain. If you guys want to save a little bit, like seventy, seventy-five dollars. Same chains, different logo, that's it. But I do handmade, which is what most people enjoy, handmade Miami Cubans. And pamps, a lot of people are into that now. And of course gold and stuff like that. So this was a review for Jacoji, man. Shout out to Jacoji, keep doing your thing. Uh, if if you're really a personal jeweler, uh, please get a phone number. Your clients are really going to appreciate it. You're going to be super busy. Your phone is going to ring. People are going to waste your time and not going to buy nothing. But that's how I go, buddy. My private jewelry company has to be like $10,000, 15000 and up. We bring the final piece to you. Sometimes arm service, depending on a client. We, you know, vices. We bring champagne. You know, we exceed the expectations. Sometimes we'll just run a suite, you know what I mean? Things like that, all over the U.S. And don't forget about the Ninja giveaway. We just need numbers, number one. And then we got to figure out a way how to raffle it off and give it away and all that. You know what I mean? All we need is the money that the bike costs, and that's it. Not how to get it to you even. Just all the money that we put into it and the bike costs. The brand new bike, we built it. It's a giveaway, but the number's not going up. So tell a friend, tell a friend, tag. You guys want to win a brand new motorcycle? Don't forget about that. And all these reviews, some things I'll keep. Some things I'll give away. You know, we can figure things out. And some things, we can sell it right back. Whoever wants them. But this is a nice chain. Again, if you guys want to. And, and these videos are for people that want to buy this. This is why it's a little lengthy. The video. Pause. Comment below. Let me know what you guys think about the chain. Number one. Anything about the video, things of that nature. And here you go for you guys that wanted to buy this chain. Now you know what time it is. Super hits. We're just in a studio where it's meant to not really make things shine. It's made to make, to be able to see things very clear. You know, but you can see this. One more time. Bong. Bong. Not switching chains. 15.1 grams. Jacoji. Oh. Peace and blessings, guys. Stay tuned for the next review. Shout out to Jacoji. Good job, brother. Keep up the good work.